Uh, hello everybody, Monkey Chris here. Today I made a language detection system. So right now I'm playing in Dutch. So if I press this button, it says, it looks like you are playing in Netherlands. Would you like to play this map in Netherlands? And you can choose either yes or no. So let me click yes. And it says, taal bijgewerkt naar Nederlands. That means language has been updated to Dutch. And uh, that's a side effect, never mind that. Um, so if I change my language to German, for example, and that takes a while. Right, if I press the button now, it says, it looks like you are playing in Deutsch. Would you like to play this map in Deutsch? And again, you can choose either yes or no. And it says that the language has been updated to Deutsch. Um, so, uh, for each language, you only need one command block. And the way this works is, well, you probably already know because of the chicken, X. So, an egg is, has a very special property. If you throw it in the air and you test for it, it is called unbekannt. That's German for unknown. So if I go to English, which also takes a while, and I do it again, it finds unknown. So what I'm doing is I'm executing uh, a tell raw command uh, on an entity with uh, the name unknown, but then for each language it's, it's different. So it will always only work for a particular language. Uh, some languages though have uh, the same word for unknown. For example, uh, Nederlands and Afrikaans. Uh, but that's fine, the languages look like each other. So, <laughs> And you probably don't have, uh, well, won't have too many, you know, in your map. Because what you can use it for is, if you have an adventure map, and players log in for the first time, you can say, oh, it looks like you are Portuguese. Oh, I think I misspelled it, by the way. Not, not sure. Anyway, um, you can give them the, the option to uh, change to Portuguese, and all the the, the whole storyline in your map could update to the language. Um, so yeah, you probably won't need hundreds of command blocks for all languages because that's a lot of effort to make to, to translate it, all of it. But for about four languages that, that could be absolutely fine. And you can also expand it to whatever you want. So I will uh, put one of the commands in the description. Uh, by the way you can, uh, right now if you click yes it only says that the language has been uploaded. If you want an actual output you can change uh, this part here to a set block command and you can set the rest of the block to next to another command block and it will do something so that's how that works so that's about it thanks for watching